Today we're going to take a look at the evolution of the coils with these Delphi coils. Now if you remember back in the 1900s, they had a distributor and a single coil that would distribute power throughout the entire engine, right? Problem with that was, is those points, those contacts would erode and wear out and you get bad flow. If you've ever seen an old timer's toolbox at the racetrack, you might see them with a fingernail file in there where you used to file down those points and then have to set the dwell and so forth. Plus you have all those moving parts, rotor buttons and so forth. So you take a leap in advance, but you get to the cassette coil. Now this was a pretty good idea because you no longer had to mechanically adjust your ignition timing. Not bad, but the problem with these coils were that if one went bad, you had to replace the entire cassette. Then we jump forward to the plug top coil. Now this made spark and spark timing a lot easier because you can do it on a per cylinder basis. Also, eliminate a spark plug wire. So pretty good advancement here, but the latest and greatest in coils is the pencil coil. Now this is the same type of stuff you're gonna see on F1 cars, 15, 16,000 RPMs. So it's got a ton of spark. Great thing about it, it doesn't look much different than the plug top coil, but it packs a real serious punch. Tighter coupling, so a better fit on the electromagnetic circuit. It's more precise, shorter distance for the spark to travel because it sits right on top of the plug. And there you go, a little rundown history of ignition coils. Find your Delphi coils at Federated Auto Parts.